As an alumnus of the Academy and currently a proud parent, I know the role of the cafeteria in our school's history. In 1959, Dolly and her husband Jim served coffee to the construction workers of the original cafeteria. Our first principal, Brother Bernard McKenna, was so impressed with her pork roll, egg, and cheeses, he asked her to operate the kitchen in September of 1961. From that point until her passing in 2018, she served every boy that walked through the academy. After 60 years, the cafeteria has remained unchanged, until now. Construction has begun to expand and remodel the space into the Brother Frank Byrne Dining Hall and Dolly Sullivan Kitchen. On Saturday, October 29th, we will be hosting a reception to educate and gain support for this groundbreaking project and to honor their unwavering commitment to CBA. It is up to us to carry on the traditions that Brother Frank and Dolly promoted and ensure this brotherhood this magical fraternity continues on for generations to come. If you have any funny stories or pictures of Frank and Dolly, please send them to the attached email address. Thank you and go Colts. During my freshman year, I quickly realized the impact that Brother Frank had on CBA as school president. As a current junior, I'm excited to know that my senior class next year will be able to experience the brand new Brother Frank Byrne Dining Hall. Students who have gotten to know Brother Frank are not surprised that this new facility will bear his name. I am sure the dining hall will open new possibilities when it comes to programs and activities at CBA, which will make our senior year even better. It's even more special to know that we were Brother Frank's last freshman class, and now we will be able to honor his impact by being among the first to use the Byrne Dining Hall. Students like Chris and every other student at CBA, every single day, will benefit from this important project. The expanded dining hall and renovated kitchen will have great nutritional and educational benefits for our students. The state-of-the-art kitchen will allow more on-site food preparation, providing healthier food options for our young men. The expanded dining space will be 40% larger than our previous cafeteria, which means far more students can eat lunch at any one time. Lunch at a centralized time during the school day for all students avoids those unusually early and late lunches, which make school more difficult both in the classroom and in athletics and extracurriculars. This new facility will also allow us to revamp our academic curriculum to allow more elective courses that our students are interested in, further enhancing CBA's well-rounded curriculum. In addition, the new dining hall will be an important hub for student life, where young men can gather for informal activities and club meetings. And students will be able to socialize over breakfast and after school, aside from their lunch periods. This attractive dining area will double as a welcoming space for parent and alumni events. The Brother Frank Byrne Dining Hall and Dolly Sullivan Kitchen are ushering in a new era here at CBA, and we hope to see you on October 29th in support of this important initiative.